bounce between Robert Whitaker and Robert Whitaker. Ready. You ready to fight? All right, so we got two classically trained strikers here. Any chance this fight actually goes to the ground? This fight does not go to the ground. This one will be fought in the pocket. Two guys will stand in front of each other. They will trade punches. They will trade kicks. It's going to be a classic matchup that you normally see inside of a ring. We get it in the octagon tonight. Well, perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by this gentleman. Nice punch lands over the top. Able to check that kick as well. Looking for the takedown, he gets it. Unable to land with that punch. And that one was heavy. Wicked nice leg kick there, DC. Can't take too many of those. Oh! Vicious combo there! Back to the left hand now. Unable to connect. Head kick lands. You wonder if the offensive fighter's gonna start to get frustrated here. Most, if not all, of these shots are getting blocked. They're getting blocked because he's fighting one of the best defensive fighters in the UFC. And he landed the right hand there. Big kick land. Man, how about the steam behind that Whitaker jab tonight? Robert Whitaker is a great striker. I mean, he has it all when it comes to the stand-up and the boxing. And that is on full display right now. He's very tricky when he throws that body kick. So just over 20 total strikes have now landed for Robert Whitaker. He has a commitment to kicking tonight, and it shows. Under a minute to go. Punch is blocked. Visibly limping here. Limping here. That was a nice try. Oh! He's hurt. Says him up. Go get him. He's getting lit up right now, John. Oh! Big knee there. right there, boy. Wow. It was a good night if that landed. Throwing haymakers out of the exchange. Oh, you, ever see. you don't really stand after you take a head kick like this. That is such toughness to even be on his feet right now. All right, so there's the end of the round. He stayed committed to doing damage upstairs and landed a seminal blow in that one. It was accumulation of those strokes. And just like that, we have arrived at our second round, Robert Whitaker versus that man, Robert Whitaker. Whitaker gets hit with a kick here. Let's see how he responds. Right on the button. There's an efficiency with which he operates in these situations. He knows exactly when to throw, exactly when to hold, and it's allowing him to really control the grappling aspect of the fight. There's a song there, right? Know when to hold him, know when, when to fold him. Yep, there you absolutely. Go. 46 total strikes have now landed for Robert Whitton. And the accuracy rate about 42% now against Robert Whitton. Oh, nice job working hard, posting, and getting back up. Nice straight punch. Oh, that's 
is a good combination from the former middleweight champion Robert Whitaker right there. He's flowing, man. And when he's flowing, he's a problem. And right now, the problem is growing for his opponent. All right, well, he's landed some good shots tonight, but there's no three-piece, there's no soda. More often than not, it's one and done. He's not even getting a combination. I mean, <laughs> if you're gonna sit there at the drive-thru, <laughs> order a combination, take the soda with your food, give him the right hand behind the jab, give him the hook behind the right hand. Jab, right hand, hook, that's two pieces of chicken and a biscuit. Finish him off with the uppercut. That is your soda. I mean, come on, man, let this guy have the whole thing. Big punch lands over the top. How's he gonna follow this one? Oh, tagged him with that right hand. What a strike that was. He landed it perfectly. Perfect placement, perfect position. What a huge blow in a big moment in this fight. Looked like he might have landed there. Instead, a swing and a miss. Nice move done as he gets the double leg take there. Oh, back up again. You can't hold a good man down. Pretty significant well to the left side. Well, a really good second round for him thus far. After a somewhat lackluster first round, he has found the rhythm and found his striking range. Oh, right under the elbow, right on the It was a perfectly placed shot, and you see his opponent reacting violently from that point. Just misses with that one. 20 seconds to go, round two. Oh, straight away. Go! Oh, look at him jumping in to try to get the finish. And what a round! All right, all right, all right, calm down, calm down. You've been hit with bigger shots than that, all right? You're gonna shake this off, you're gonna come back, and you're gonna win. You ready to fight? You ready? Third round underway. Big ball punch land. Now we get back to range. aggressive as he was in the previous round, landing a high volume of strikes, but he's also been efficient, not just with his strikes, but also with his body movement. Complete performance out of this fighter here tonight. 71 total strikes have now landed for Robert. Oh! Oh! He's out! He's done, he's done! Just an absolutely gorgeous shot to spell the end for his opponent. Crowd is absolutely loving it. He gets the near-perfect land. I'm not even sure his opponent saw it coming, but just the way he drew it up here tonight, saw that little crack of an opening and barged right through it to get the knockout. All right, let's get you some replays now. Certainly a lot for our replay guys to work with in the truck. This was a clinic tonight in terms of mixed martial arts acumen in every realm of the game. A full-on display of all of his skills. He did everything in this championship-winning performance. He used his wrestling. He used his elbows. He used his pace and pressure to really wear down his opponent so that he can get his hand raised. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean is going to stop to this Trigger.